yeah. I, oh, there's one. Look at that. There's an Indominus right there. I want that Indominus. He, I, watch. Oh, boom. Hey guys, this is Raider X. And I'm back in Ark. Uh, survival evolved actually and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually change this series to a let's play because I'm gonna just kind of play as I go the servers seem to evolving be evolving quicker than I can record and I'm finding really cool servers out there and so um, I wanted to show off some of those servers I wanted to show you some of the gameplay from some of these servers, and these are all unofficial servers, and they're modded. Uh, the one I'm in currently, I've created a little building here, a little base out of metal. It's highly modded. It has lots of mods, tons of mods, actually, and it takes me about a good five minutes to log in. No, no joke. And uh, everything you can imagine is on this server. Uh, not only are the drakes and the wyverns you know uh from anunnaki because this is an has an anunnaki mod uh, on it but it also has all of the scorched earth dinos on it and even has some scorched earth uh biomes on it i've been in the biome the redwood biome so it has kind of an odd mixture of different mods and uh it, it really is a really cool server um, and I wanted to show it off. So, let's get into it a little bit. This is my little base. I have a one-story, well, it's two-story, but this, the first story has, like, all of my chests in it, has the workbenches, even the Anunnaki workbench. It has stuff like the, um, um, the hairdo-style uh, mod, you know, so I could be Kylo Ren, you know, attach it to my hat and have a Kylo Ren hat on, you know, Kylo Ren skin on. So, it has a lot of really cool uh, features. It has a marketplace so that I could go out and sell, um, you know, sell stuff if I want to. There's a market cart. There's, a, I also have, let's see, oh, maybe it's this side. Yep. I have a second story. You'll notice it's long and thin, right? But I do have a second story. I'm starting to build stuff in here. Okay. The uh, drops, the supply crates in this one is, are absolutely ridiculous. They're full of, I mean, you can look at my inventory. They're full of celestial equipment. Okay. And if you look at some of my chests, I have tons of different celestial items. So this server kind of goes above and beyond giving you what you need to survive, of course. Um, but the dinos seem to hit very hard on this server, and there are a lot of them, and there are a lot, um, you know, it, it, there are a lot of crazy dinos on here. Okay, I have just a few. I just started, not uh, maybe a day or so ago. So, just to show off a few of my dinos, I have these, I have two of these, they are the Elder Cryo Goddesses, okay, I have two of them, uh, they basically freeze anything that I want them to freeze and then I can tame it, I have the Elder Blackheart Godling, which is the Blackheart Godling, which is not a flying dino, he's a regular dino, a uh, ground dino, and he is a, a, probably my number one killer, um, He's my highest level. And so when I run around on the ground, he kills everything. I do have a Alpha... Um, I have an Alpha Rex. And I have another godling here, the, the Drago godling. Okay? And I have this real neat Orc Nemesis. Okay? Um, and he's rideable. So I can ride him around. Okay? And you'll notice my suit here. 
I got the 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 tech suit on. Okay. Um, if I put that away, I have the real cool shield, so you can the, the see-through shield, but it's uh, very um, the max protection on it's very high. Okay. So I thought maybe we would go out and just see what kind of craziness is out here. I'm on the cliff side. I'm on the center map. Okay, if you look out over the center map, um, it, it, it's a very big world. There's a lot to see and do on this world. And again, there's a lot of creatures in this world. Um, my bullets are, let me show you here. My bullets are called, the, they're trank rounds that go inside my, my, my long range rifle. And so I can hit things from distance and knock them out and then tame them. Okay. Now, not saying that it's super powerful for, you know, some of the big high dinos, but it definitely does its job uh, for any mid-range, small to mid-range dino. So I'm going to take off. I'm going to look around. I'm going to show you some of these places. These people have spent some time on this server. I can tell. They have some really cool dinos. And the, um, the big powerful... Prime dinos all spawn, spawn here all over the place, so you can tame more than one of them. Okay, if you have the, if you have all the stuff, you can tame all of them. Okay, I do need a bigger kind of wyvern. This, like for instance, this gentleman has the big wyvern. Okay, you can see it here. Okay, uh, I don't know if you saw it here. Let me try to get up there. Okay, so I need a big wyvern, um, and, and you see they have all these skins for all these dinos in this in this mod. I mean, in this server. So all your flying uh, dragons can look really cool, have some really cool tech on them. Um, and again, I need to find me, you know, like a big wyvern so that now now don't get me wrong, my goddess does pretty good. Um, you know, all three, uh, all four of them, the godlings and the god goddesses do really well. But, for instance, her, her health is up to 20 million. And I really need a dino that's big enough to take 60 million. Um, and the reason why I need a dino with that much health is that I want to go kill the wardens. There's all kinds of wardens on here. And then with the wardens, I can then go get the prime, the prime dinos. Um... Primordius, for instance, I want to get Primordius, which Primordius spawns on the center of the center of, the, of on the center map, spawns in the middle, um, and and there's tons of them to, to find in the middle, so I can tame myself one of those. Okay, and so I really want to do that, so I need to um, get me a big dino. In other words. I want to get me a wyvern so that I can conquer the rest of this map. Now, one thing this server has, which is really nice, is it has a castle mod, so you can build castles. Okay, you can build really neat structures on here. Okay, out of really neat materials. So just to be, just to show you, for instance. Um, go to one of the big castles that one of the players have built. I think it's over here. On our way, we'll look for um, things that I might need to tame. This has um, Indominus Rexes on it. Uh, Dodo Rexes, of course, and other more um, recognizable dinos, but the Indominus is on here in different forms. So the Indominus can do a few different things. This, this base is so big and so cool that it takes a while for it to render in on my system. And I got a beefy system. Okay. So you see the dinos inside of his facility here as it renders in. He's got a full water base castle. Okay, so it's a castle. And he has a redwood tree. Okay platform kind of thing going on here. It's pretty neat. So there's the castle. It's spawned. There it is. It's completely in now. 
okay? So if I go around to the front of his castle... Um, there's his front. So you see, you can build these really nice castles with really cool windows. Um, you know, I have a lot of cool kind of complexes going on with lots of space. Okay, see, he has a he has a primordius right there. Okay, so really neat structure he's created here. Okay, little towers and everything. Okay. So, I would like to build the same on this server. Uh, it might take me a little bit of time. Um, but, how cool would it be to have a whole setup like this? You know, in, in a... Um, survival evolved server okay so I'm gonna work on that um, and in order to do that I need to get me a bigger dino so that's the first thing I'm gonna work on today is I've already gone out and I've scoped out where the um, where the dodo rexes are I like to try to go for the dodo rexes number one they're easy to kill for my dino uh, number two they spawn not only um, a couple, I, actually they spawn all three of the trophies that I need to gather in order to make a tribute, um, a dragon tribute, a boss, I should say a boss tribute, that I can then turn into a, um, a dino, okay? Once I get the boss tribute, I can then go, it's very easy for this dino right here to go and knock out any wyvern that I feel like. Then I can put the boss tribute inside them, make them eat it, and then that's my dino. So I really need to kill a bunch of dodo rexes, and they spawn here in the forest. This is the redwood forest, where if you recall, if you've ever seen Scorched Earth, um, it has a huge uh, redwood forest in the middle of it. And this is the same kind of redwood forest that you would see there. Um, and so in this biome, I've noticed there are a lot of dodo rexes. So I'm going to go around. Ooh, is that a... That is an alpha wyvern. So it's time to kill myself an alpha wyvern. So you see, my dino is really powerful. Um, here's his stats. He has 7,200 plus melee damage. What's coming my way? Okay, that's another goddess. Um, he also has, like I said, he actually has 20 million health. 7,600 stamina, which is fine. He goes 300% faster than normal. So he definitely has enough to get by um, but the 20 million health is the important part of this equation because I'm taking on these dinos head on okay I already got everything and let's see what I get Oh yes, good. I got a dragon trophy. I needed that. I need the Magna Mega Pithecus trophy and the Broodmother trophy, and then I can make myself a boss and go find me a dragon. So that that's one of the things that I need. Uh, my gamma's a little high. I'm gonna turn that down just a tad. Is that gonna work? Let me try three. Oh, 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 oh. Did I hit the wrong button? I sure did. Okay, Gamma 3. Alright. Alright, so let me see if I can find me another Dodo. Maybe a couple more. Give me a 
couple more trophies, and then take those back and make a boss tribute. Now there's a there is a couple of godlings or goddess I think they're godlings. Look like they're all tame. <laughs> okay, you can keep those. I got a, I got those. There's a goddess up there. Um, all I'm really worried about, really care about, I really don't want to fight those right now. I could even like knock them out and take them back home, but. My main purpose is to get the big wyvern. There's another really cool base down here. And it always has some, uh... Wow, somebody's been clearing these out. Here's this guy's base. It looks like maybe a little, uh, medieval village. Really nice. It's right on the waterfall. Okay. Waterfall here on the center map. Falls down. Okay, he's right next to it. Very nice base. Very nice setup he's got going here. Alright. If you've ever played Scorched Earth, if you watched it on YouTube, uh, it looks exactly like this. Very nice setup. Okay, I got a brood mother. I got a brood mother trophy. There. So I got one of each. Now if I can just get the magna mag megapithes megapithesis. Let me make sure I didn't get that. No, I just got the brood mother. All right, so now I need to make a pithesis. And now I yeah, earlier today I killed uh, a, a golden dodo on the beach. Oh, there's one. And I got a bunch of golden uh, trees. Okay, I got another. Got another brood mother. I need a megapithesis. Uh, megapithecus. Why is it so hard for me to say? Okay. Another neat. Um, I think there's a. Yeah, there's a base right here. Another neat mod on this is it has a Jurassic Park mod. So you could put the fences up that are electrocute. That are electrified. And when a dino runs into it. Let's see if this one runs into it. Boom! You see that? Two million damage, instantly dead and gone. Okay, I, I would imagine I get the same damage, so I kind of stay clear of their. There's a megapithecus right there. Uh, I stay clear of their uh, their fences, but it's a Jurassic Park fence, and a, you could have the main gate as a Jurassic Park main gate too. Okay, please give me. Okay, another dragon. Okay, just keep going. I won't stop till I kill them all. Let me see how his health is doing. Yeah, his health has not moved. So these guys aren't really doing any damage to me, really. Um, I'm way more powerful than they are. So I, all I gotta really do is keep killing them until... See, here's the Indominus. This Indominus, which is tamed, it looks like, um, it puts out this sonic boom that will render me disabled from flying. And then it also sends out alpha, like raptors, I think. Like, it's minions or alpha raptors, and they go chase you around until they kill you. Very powerful dino, and I'd like to get one of those. I'm going to have to search around for one of those uh, on this map for a while. But I certainly would like one. There is a wild uh, dark heart godling right there. Okay. So, yeah. I, oh, there's one. Look at that. There's an Indominus right there. 
I want that Indominus. He, I, watch. Oh, boom. You see how I spit out that sonic boom? That sonic boom. Oh. That's, now he sent out his little minions, I think. Yeah, see his little minions running around? To kill everything? And they're all alphas. Okay. Now, they're not going to do a whole lot of damage to me. Oh, see how he just rendered me where I can't fly. And then he'll try to chase me down. Um, but up in the top right corner, you'll notice that I'm unable to fly for 16 seconds. Which is fine. I'm powerful enough. I don't want to hurt him. I want to, like, the, my breath will knock him out. Eventually. If I can knock him out, I'll take him home, and that'll be part of my episode. I'm trying to stay away from him, because if he launches again, yeah, I do not want to be knocked out. <laughs> and he's going to send out more of this. I think that, that, you saw that little bubble on him that time? Oh, he disappeared. He has another mechanism. He disappears. He becomes invisible. So I have to hit him in order to find him. Oh, look at that. Knocked him out. Okay, so... This is going to be tricky. Let's go kill this... His minions so they don't so they don't kill me. Oh, I got him. So I have me. It's called. Look at him. Am I riding him? Oh, I can ride him without a saddle. Would you look at there? No saddle for him. Watch this. Boom. That blast. Um, so I can ride him without a saddle. He does already. Let me speed him up. He, by himself, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, he does a million three damage just without doing anything else. Okay, I'm going to have my guy follow me. I didn't know I could ride him without a saddle. That's awesome. Okay. I'm going to take him home. Come on, goddess. There you go. Um, I didn't expect this to be part of my episode, but hey, I just got an Indominus Rex that had a nemesis. Um, I can't help but take this home. Okay. Let's see what his bite power is. Ah, uh, 6,000. I haven't even done any leveling up on that yet. What's up? Oh! Oh, that's the other one. I thought, man, I can get two of them. Oh, that's the other other tamed one. <laughs> so, uh, um, yeah, he's a very cool dino. Um, I, I really haven't seen much of him on servers before. So I'm going to take him home. No, I don't want to mess with that guy right now. I don't want to mess with the dodos. I'll come back for the dodos on the next episode and try to finish my quest. Can he swim well? I certainly hope he can swim well. Oh, he can. Oh, he swims really well. For a big dino. But I'm going to have to learn, and on the next episode I'll show you what, how he um, breathes his, uh, you know, minions, how he spits them out, and how he makes you, disables you, and we'll test him out on the next episode, but it's really cool that I got one. Um, 
wasn't expecting to find one. They're really kind of hard to find, in my opinion. I've looked around this map a couple times and haven't found anything to this level. So, uh, but I'm going to take him home real quick. We'll drop him off. We'll say adios to this episode, and we'll come back on the next one showing him off. Is my goddess uh, following me? Yeah. Whoa, what are you doing? Oh, I hit my hand, huh? Okay. Yeah, is she following? Where is she? Oh, she's underwater. Hi there. Okay. Come on. I'm like hitting stuff underwater, aren't I? Rocks or something. Anyway, there's my little island. I always can tell my little island because I have a little archway on the right side of it. Uh, I'm out kind of in the middle of nowhere on the map. But that's the way I like it. I've been thinking about moving out to this island. Or, I mean, one of these... I'm sorry, not this one, but one of the islands that's empty. Okay, where's my... Did she get stuck somewhere? Where are you? All right, come on. Come on. Can't leave you behind, lady. I don't know why you're going under the water. You should be flying up top. You're being a weirdo. You really are. You're a flying dino. Get up in the freaking sky. Yeah, he's really slow. I'm gonna have to speed him up. He's faster swimming than he is on the on the actual or on the ground. But this is really cool. I'm happy to get this one. He's actually pretty high level. I think he's around 800. Um, so we will do our best to get him up to like 1200 or more and we'll go ride him and do some damage I'm really stoked that it doesn't take a saddle or nothing it's just plain old ride on my back uh, dino and I really to be honest I've only owned one of these before as part of a tribe and I never have owned one on my own so this is really a treat for me to get him. And it may be a her, I'm not sure. We'll have to find out. He looks cool. Look at the little spikes look like dangerous. Let me get rid of some of this stuff here. He collects wood too, look at that. He's like her, because my goddess. What are you what are you stuck on? Are you stuck on her? Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, come on. Come on. Oh, where am I? Are you guys coming or what? What are you guys doing? You're acting really weird. Just come over here. Yeah, yeah, knock down all the trees. Get them out of your way. All right, I'm going to have to ride her back, okay? Knock down some of the trees so you can get in here. Oh, 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 here. Stop. Stop. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Why are you following here? Okay, everyone stop following each other, okay? Can you do that, maybe? Um, I think this tree is in the way. <laughs> that That's one problem with these dinos. They go forever to go stop somewhere. They're like, you got in the middle of nowhere. And why can't I ride you? Okay, I'm glitching out. Okay, you're over 
there. She went all the way down here. Why? I'm not sure. Um, okay. So the goddess is back. There we go. I got myself an Indominus. Oh, you know what? He's full of wood. Maybe I can level him up real quick. Okay. So you should be able to, be able to carry that. Okay. Alright. So. There's my Indominus. Okay. The red eyes got my other dinos over there so I'm gonna leave this episode but I I'm happy you stopped by again we're gonna start a let's play with the series and I'm just gonna show off some of the dinos that I find and capture them bring them home try them out see what they do um, we will make a bigger base we'll make a castle We'll just do, I'm going to spend some time on Chronic's server. Chronic is the owner, and I'm going to spend some time on his server uh, building myself up. Now, tomorrow, there is a Dino Wipe. Not a Structure Wipe, just a Dino Wipe. So all these Dinos that I've collected will be gone. He will give us all um, a dragon of some sort to start us off, since he's wiping all the Dinos to, to help with lag. But then I'll come back, I'll use my new Dino, and find these guys all again. So again, thank you for joining me. Hit the like button if you like what you've seen in this video. Please subscribe to my channel and we'll make this a thing. Okay, we'll make this a thing. We'll do this all the time. And until next time, whoop, whoop, whoop. this is Raider X and I'm out.